I saw this video of this kid <laughs> he working at Starbucks on the verge of tears where he is crying uh, about just having to work and go to school. You, you need a job. No, I don't want a job. Look at this. It's incredible. People wonder why we need a union at Starbucks. And I am literally about to quit. Like, I, I don't know if I'm going to do it, but like, I really want to. I almost walked out today and I'm crying in the back room right now and I almost cut on the floor. It's just, <laughs> I like, I get, I'm like a full-time student. I get scheduled for 25 hours a week. And then on weekends, they schedule me the entire day open to close up on the schedule for eight and a half hours. You mean like what everybody has to do? I'm like three and a half hours into my shift. There's so many customers and we have four people on the floor all day. <laughs> Only five people were put on the schedule and somebody had to call out. And there are four people running the whole store and there's so many customers and there's possibly scheduled five people. <laughs> I mean, what do you expect to do before? What do you, ex how do you expect to make money before you have a career? You got to do shitty jobs. You got to do jobs you don't want to do. You're paying your dues. Everybody has to do this. I mean, these kids are so confused these days to begin with. You see what's happening with this generation. So many of them are lost. So many of them are, have anxiety. Uh, they don't want to work. I think the best thing would be to start with a job. No. Yeah, absolutely. No. She needs a job. No. Like, what do they think when they when they hear about people coming over to America in like the late 1800s on a fucking ship, you know, and then they got to work on a railroad, you know, they live at a house with no electricity, probably. I mean, it just we only have 13 people employed at this store and there's so many customers. And they get a good... How do you, how do you expect to gain any respect from society being this way? I, I just and why would you film this moment? Do you know how embarrassing this is? Why would you capture this? What would you like to get out of this? Like donations, <laughs> like like a hug. What are you looking for here? We don't have fair scheduling. Managers don't care about us. Our manager was supposed to come in this weekend and he took himself off the schedule so he wouldn't be able to be held accountable for calling out. He just literally tore down the schedule that he was scheduled on and put up a new schedule where he wasn't on the schedule. Also, he couldn't have even seen that he was scheduled in the first place because he didn't want to be held accountable for not wanting to come in. <laughs> I mean, this is forever now. This is recorded forever. I'm like at my wits end with this job. I really am. <laughs> I just want to be able to 